Hi everyone, Jason here with another Carvera Air how-to. And in this one, we're looking at how to update the firmware of our Carvera Air desktop CNC. As new features and updates become available, users can download and update the firmware on the Carvera Air using the Carvera controller app that's installed on a Windows, Mac, Linux, or tablet device. After powering on your Carvera Air, launch the controller app on your device. From within the app, connect to the Carvera Air either by using the USB port on the back of the machine or through the Wi-Fi as shown in another one of our tutorial videos. Once connected, we can check the current firmware version in the MDI window by clicking on the button in the bottom left corner of the controller. The version will always be displayed when first connecting to your machine, but you can also send the version command to show the current version at any time. To update your firmware, we want to open up the menu from the top right corner of the controller, and if a controller or firmware update is available, this menu icon will have a small blue dot as shown. From within this menu, click the Upgrade icon to open the Upgrade window, then switch to the Firmware tab. Next, we can click the Download button to launch your web browser and download the firmware file if you have not already done so. Firmware can be obtained from the software page of makehera.com, and both the Carvera and Carvera Air use the same firmware file. You can also browse Makehera's GitHub for release notes and previous versions. Once we've downloaded a firmware bin file for our device, we can return to the Carvera controller app. In the upgrade window that we were in before, we can click the update button to launch a file browser. From here, navigate to the location of the firmware file on your device, select it, and then click upload. Prior to updating the firmware, the controller will prompt you that a machine reset is required. Click confirm to start the updating process. Once the update is complete, you will be notified that a reset is needed. Press confirm to have the Carvera Air automatically cycle power and reboot. Once the Carvera Air has fully rebooted, we can reconnect to it via the controller app and confirm our new firmware version from the MDI window. And that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching. Of course, please don't forget to subscribe and check out more how-tos and guides on the Makehera channel and wiki site.